Summer House Season 7 Preview is pulling out all the stops by previewing the dramatic fight that led to the fallout between Lindsay Hubbard and Daniel Oliveira. It all begins when the duo was discussing Carl Racky moving in with Hubbard, whom Oliveira seemed to be against. Why do I need your blessing? The 36-year-old questioned Oliveira in the clip to which she responded saying, what you're saying is absolute crazy pants to me. Of course, we know that Hubbard has not only since moved in with Radke, but also got engaged a few months ago in August. It was already public knowledge that the former BFFs had a fallout, and although the main reason was also revealed, Summer House fans will get to witness all the saucy details captured on camera in Season 7. To get engaged right now would be crazy. The 38-year-old further adds her plans to which Hubbard sarcastically replied, Maybe we won't get engaged when it's appropriate for you. The tension only grew as the entire cast stayed in the Hamptons, with Hubbard again confronting Oliveira later in another scene. You bashed me the entire summer. Hubbard accused Oliveira as her co-stars awkwardly listened from the other room. I don't talk shit about you. I say it to your face. Oliveira later defended herself in tears to Maya Allen. This is beyond repair. Hubbard spoke with people about this fallout in October, saying we have a very complicated friendship at times, and we're in the middle of a complicated situation. She seemed to be hopeful that they would eventually reconcile, though. Hopefully it'll all work out, Hubbard said optimistically. I have a lot of faith, and I hope that when you have a very strong, solid bond, many years of friendship, that all will work out in the end. So we'll see. The fallout wasn't the only intense part of the trailer. Radke was also having problems in his business relationship with housemates Amanda Batula and Kyle Cook. Radke works as a vice president of sales of the couple's beverage company, Lover Boy. He's checked out, Cook claimed. Ever since he's been dating Lindsay, he's been doing less. Radke felt contrary, saying, I've been working my ass off and it's not good enough. Cook also seems to be having his own problems with Batula. You understand we can't get pregnant yet, she tells her husband, linking to her fertility issues. What if there's something wrong, she says. I just don't know. I just want to go home with our dogs and be home, she tearfully tells him. Paige DeSorbo can be seen struggling with her long-distance relationship with her boyfriend, Craig Conover, as well. I feel like there is a lot of pressure, she says, as a flashback clip of him asking her to come to visit him in Charleston, South Carolina, plays. You're making it seem like if I don't say we're going to get engaged in six months, you're going to be pissed off at me, she tells her Southern Charm star partner. At least one person can be seen happy, and that is Shiera Miller, along with her new friend, Chris Leone. We see glimpses of debutant Samantha Fair and Gabby Prescott, the latter of whom claims her ex cheated on her with Oliveira. Winter House's Corey Kiefer and former House Summer House's Andrea Denver are also seen, so make sure to catch all of them and the action in Summer House Season 7 premiering on February 13th at 9 p.m. ET.